All right. So before we start on this journey, let me give you guys some context of how I got to this point. So first of all, these are my friends, Karis <laughs> and Young. I met them a couple months ago playing volleyball at the beach. So as some of you may know, I've been pretty bored and overall I just feel really stuck on this island. So yeah, I thought what better way to fix my boredom, build new friendships, and overall just get a change in scenery than to go to the big island. Dude, this is look like planet Earth. Right, uh, I specifically requested. <laughs> and we will have fun. Um, yes. Whoa. <laughs> we're at the car in the middle of nowhere. <laughs> oh my god. What's up guys? Young just went to bed and we leave tomorrow morning. Actually in a couple hours, so I'm probably gonna get like four hours of sleep. I can't believe I'm about to go on a trip with people I sort of just met. This is like probably one of the most spontaneous things I've ever done. So that's like three days and we have no hotel. So we're gonna sleep in the car. Um, no plans, but it's gonna be a lot of fun. That's all for now. I'll see you guys in the morning. Fifteen in the morning, and we are getting the essentials, of course. So much on vibes, feel the same we had it last year. It's like we set the lime on a new plantation. All right, so we officially made it to Hilo. First time I've been here since like I think like second or third grade. We are gonna be calling an Uber. Young is getting an Uber, so we can get to our. It's not a rent a car. We can get to this like random guy's house. He has a car. That's the plan. But he's Christian, so it's okay. <laughs> he's not gonna kill us. Oh, okay. Cool. oh man. Alright. So okay, so we got a car. Come on. Thank you. Thank you. And just like that, Young and I started our journey across the island. We drove for a few hours all the way from Kona to Hilo. And we made some stops along the way. Yeah. This is crazy. Alright, check out this view. It's not the most scenic, but it's still like unlike anything I've ever seen. So we are walking to a lava tube right now. So lava tubes form when hot lava on the outside cools, but the inside of the tube continues to be hot. And then eventually all of that lava just runs out, leaving the cold outer shell. Whoa. You're inside of a lava tube. Like, what? <laughs> and after a lot more driving and some naps, we finally made it to the Black Sand Beach. <laughs> That's insane! With low tide too, it's perfect for picking. Damn! What? Oh my gosh! Dude, Young, no way! This is sick! Dude. It's like fucking charcoal! <laughs> I still can't get over how oh, black the sand is. Ooh, it's so cool! <laughs>
on the hunt for a Karis. Hello? White Nissan, uh, white Nissan SUV. Wait, what? 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 <laughs> what? <laughs> I was like, we're gonna like film her. <laughs> Oh, oh my god, it's Karis! <laughs> oh my god, Karis! <laughs> oh my god, we haven't seen her in so long! <laughs> Alright, this is what we're working with. Everyone's in the car. Yay! But I only have one earplug. <laughs> Alright, day two. We have successfully slept in the back of the car. Yay! <laughs> Quite the endeavor, but we got it done. All right, uh, get some groceries, and then we get some breakfast. And then I think the plan is what, to hike um, Haleakala? Okay. Yeah, and I think that's the plan. Rainbow, uh, Falls. Rainbow Falls? Okay, so Rainbow Falls and Haleakala, that's the plan. All right, so we made it to, it's called Rainbow Falls. Pretty touristy to track the place, but pretty nice. And afterwards, we drove up into the clouds. Literally. Literally, quite literally, in a cloud. Like, the whole thing was just coming up and I was like, is that rain? And then I was like, <laughs> no, that's a cloud. Okay, I feel like this is a layer situation. No way, what? <laughs> <gasps> yeah, it's a layer situation. <laughs> oh my god, I know, Karis, I don't believe you. <laughs> oh my god, it's a layer situation. We are all now geared up. I'm ready to go. Oh, I need water. It's that long, is it? Oh. Oh. It's not long for Braden, though. Well, parked the car in the middle of nowhere, and apparently the hike's up there. Kind of nuts. Like, what the heck? We were literally putting on sunscreen. We are just talking about this. We were literally putting on sunscreen, like, almost an hour ago, and now we are wearing layers. Jeez. And after wandering around for a couple hours, we finally reached the cave. <gasps> oh my god! It's the cave! <laughs> Alright, so we made it to the cave. Oh! It's kind of cool. He has a headlamp. Okay. So, he has to go first. God damn it. Okay, here we go. Holy shit, like this green stuff? Go, <laughs> uh. so, right? We decided to go, right? We go? Oh my god. We go together? <laughs> no, we're going! I'm following you! Like a, like a snake. Like that. Basilisk. 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 This could be like the stomach, right? Like, look. <laughs> Those are actually bones. Yeah. Oh my god, dude. Oh my god, I'm actually getting the creep. Oh my god! There's something wrong. I can't die before I go to college. We just made it back from the cave. It's a home base white swan. It's a home base white swan. We're like really precariously parked on all these rocks. But it's fine. So after eating dinner, the plan was to drive up to Haleakala and possibly stay the night there. But we ran into some complications. Okay, we're gonna have to reassess. Yes. So, okay, slow down, slow down. This is the turn. So, okay, so I'm gonna turn so, so, so stop. Okay. Yeah. Just let's uh, pull over right here. Yeah. Okay. Um, there's also no reception here. Okay. Okay, so basically, we should have gotten fuel. Yeah, so <laughs> we didn't. Yeah, that's what I was thinking, because I was like, okay, we only have a quarter tank. Yeah. And now we only have 33 miles, and it's 15 again. Um, let's take a look. So unless we can like, unless when oh, I need, no. 